guy comes up and he walks into the patio with a white bucket and he goes, I need five gallons of beer for my donkey. I would describe the cowgirl as being quintessential Santa Fe. Well, first of all, we're really cool. You come into your living room. The living room? Maybe? We're the living room of Santa Fe. And he goes, no, no, really. I've got a donkey around the corner and he needs, and this is the only thing he drinks is beer. In terms of all of the different people with different lifestyles, ages, incomes, that come and hang out here, whether they're enjoying food or enjoying music. The guy really had a donkey and he run, and five minutes later he showed up and marched him into the middle of the patio and we served the donkey the five gallons of beer. If you have a donkey that will consume beer, he has to do it on our premises. Early on it became part of our mission was to have music here at the restaurant because it, it drives the whole lifestyle thing. It's kind of a roadhouse feel that, that we wanted to have and, and that works quite well. If we have groups that come in here, they've never played before, they'll ask, where's the stage? And I go, right there. We'll, we'll move the tables and we'll tape off the bathroom. Uh, okay, no, really, where's the sound person? No, we don't really, we don't have a sound person. You're on your own. Sometimes they're a little bit disappointed. And then it's like, you got a contract, and you have to play, and they play, and at the end they're like, when can we come back? The cowgirl brand has a lot to do with wholesome, old west cowgirl ethics. It's a soulful kind of place. You know, it's like soulful like some places might be in New Orleans. It's groovy. 